Hey everybody, Cajun Chef here. All right, today we're gonna make egg casserole. This is gonna be a pretty uh, easy recipe, pretty short, hopefully, video. Start off with uh, one pound of ground up breakfast sausage, which it comes in a little pack, you just break it up in the pot. Um, once you're done browning it, which it takes, I don't know, my stove it takes, I don't know, 10 or 15 minutes, drain it, this is what you have, the browned uh, breakfast sausage. All right, take six slices of bread, cut them into squares or break them apart, however you want to do it. Um, as long as they get broken up into almost even pieces, it's okay. All right, so once you have the pieces uh, broken up, you can just throw them into a, uh, I use a 13 by nine uh, baking pan. And then you want to get six eggs uh, crack them into something that's going to be large enough to whisk all this stuff together. I use a pancake bowl. Uh, whatever you want to do, just crack six eggs into it and get two cups of milk. Alright, here we are. Now we got our six eggs cracked. We will pour two cups of milk. Like so. Alright, now you want to grab a couple of pinches of salt. Maybe a little bit more. All right, now that you got your mixture completely done, you want to add two cups of shredded cheese. I just use shredded cheddar, mild cheddar. All right, get that added and mix that up good. Then you want to add the ground up breakfast sausage. Like I said, you're going to add everything into this bowl. <laughs> Take the bread. Dump it in there as well. Once you get all the bread added and stirred, uh, some people say you should let it sit for eight hours, and that's a that's a preference if you want to do that. It does make it better, but sometimes, like usually when I cook it, I don't plan on cooking it eight hours later. I plan on cooking it like 30 minutes later. So I don't let it soak usually, but I have done it, and it does make it better. Once you get all that mixed, here we go. You're going to pour that back into the pan. It doesn't, it doesn't look very good right now, but it, it will when it's done. So spread it out evenly. Again, here you go, 13 by nine inch baking pan. Get it spread out evenly. Which? Now, based on my prompter here it says to bake at 350 degrees for 40 to 45 minutes my family could not wait for me to get a picture of it before they ate so that's what they took out of it but again it is it's very good it's a it's a good quick easy breakfast idea or afternoon meal like I said it was gonna be a pretty short video you know give it a try it's, it's a really quick cheap and I think it's a pretty darn good uh, recipe. Let me know what you think, and if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to my channel. Thanks.